This is a demonstration of how to check Ysnap configuration using a USB to RS-232 adapter on a MacBook Pro. First, you take your Ysnap, which has already been set up on your Enterprise Wireless LAN. For setup details, visit SerialIO.com to see the many options available. Here, we have our USB to serial cable attached to our Mac with a null modem adapter. For power, we are using a 9 volt to USB cable. Before applying power, we start our terminal program on the Mac and open the connection port of the USB to serial adapter. The port name on a Mac is normally USB to serial or some variation. The bitrate needs to be 9600 to match the default settings of the Ysnap RS-232 port. Now we apply power to the Ysnap and we will see the Ysnap start up and connect to the wireless LAN and you can see what IP it connects as. In this example we're using SerialIO.com's Java Term program which runs on OS X, Windows, Linux, and other systems. Java Term has an option to connect directly to the Ysnap, so here we select the TCP IP settings in Java Term, and we can enter the IP address manually, which we know from the terminal output, or here we'll just use the Ysnap discovery option. The Ysnaps on the wireless LAN will show up, and you can pick the one you want to connect to and connect. So now we are connected to the Ysnap over the wireless LAN we can do our setup wirelessly using Java Term. Here we'll go into command mode and issue get E, which gives us all the settings. We'll exit command mode and unplug our USB to serial adapter and plug in our serial device that we want to test. In this case, we're using a laser champ RS-232 laser barcode scanner to scan the barcode on this Dryers Max ice cream container. And the barcodes are appearing in our Java Term program. Wirelessly enabling legacy and other RS-232 serial devices is a snap. Contact SerialIO.com for more details on the Y-Snap. Thanks for watching.